Hi, this video tutorial will look at the when green flag clicked block. So if you're not familiar with some of the blocks in Scratch, you know you've got a um, tip section that you can open up. So let's jump into my uh, events tab and open this up and we've got a little tutorial here on the, the when green flag clicked. So let me click onto that. So basically what this does is that it runs a script when the green flag is clicked, which means when you've created a Scratch project or a Scratch game and you want to be able to start the game or start the project, you may want to use this, um, the green flag, to actually kickstart the game off. So we need to apply this particular event block onto particular scripts or um, codes that you want to run. So for this example, um, it's got go to X and Y coordinates, zero, move 10 steps and then turn 15 degrees forever and apply this action when the green flag clicked is clicked on. So let's have a, a look at how we can actually replicate that example. So I'll go into my motions uh, tab and let's just uh, grab my go to X and Y coordinates block. I'll click onto my move 10 steps block and let me just click onto the move 10 steps just, just to show you how it works. So you can see that my cat sprite is moving 10 steps which is great. Um, but maybe I want my cat sprite to turn. So let's just click onto this again and see how it works. So what it's doing is it's moving 10 steps and then it's actually turning 15 by 15 degrees. So we want this action to occur um, forever and ever. So let's just go into my control tab, click onto um, my forever block, drag it out and make sure my scripts that I want to run are placed inside my forever block. Let's place the go to X and Y coordinates on top of my forever block because that's what I want to do is I want my cat sprite to be right in the middle, which is a go to X zero and Y zero coordinates and then move 10 steps and then turn by 15 degrees forever and ever. So how do I actually start this project? Well, I'll go into my events, click onto my green flag is clicked block, drag that out and snap it on the top. So let me just get rid of that section here and let's click onto this to see how it works. And there you have it. So when the green flag is clicked, it goes right in the middle, the center of the backdrop and it moves 10 steps and then it turns by 15 degrees forever and ever and ever. And that's how you can apply the when green flag is clicked block. Let me just stop that. And if I'm about to start my game, I can click onto my green flag and there you go. And that's how you can apply the when green flag clicked block. 